What's going on everybody? This is Fry. So here's the backstory of today's stream. Yesterday I was playing a deck uh, called the, it was the Neptuna uh, Flag Conjure deck. It went extremely well. Uh, so if you haven't seen that video, you can check that out. That'll probably, if you're watching this on YouTube, that will be the last YouTube video here on Fry Up Gaming. Um, so the only person who was able to beat me was uh, the guy, his name was Eric GW2. I'm guessing this stands for Garden Warfare. If anyone knows him, Send him our way, send him towards this video or live stream. Um, he played some crazy, crazy combos, and he uh, will therefore always be known on this channel as the Giga Chad Eric GW2. Now, the, here's the kind of stuff he was doing to me. He was playing Snapdragon, getting a good value off of this. Again, in the right circle, you can't force this card. But in the right circumstances, they commit, you know, something on turn four. You can get a lot of value, really kill things for free. And, you know, you'll still have a 3-3 splash damage on the field. He was taking minions and throwing them to the lane after the, um, after the Snapdragon. Like, he set up his Snapdragon on 4, and then played, then he played Banana Peel and Plant Food the next turn to, like, completely decimate my board. Um, it just seems like really cool combos when you're using Banana Peel and moving things to the right. So we're trying to replicate the deck. Uh, that he was using. He was also using Repeat Moss. I don't even remember how many Repeat Moss he was using, but he was using Banana Peel to put things in front of the Repeat Moss to be able to get some free damage, uh, which is cool. Um, the other thing I'm going to be running, which I did not see uh, in that deck, is Rotabaga, because I think he can do the same idea. You're able to put this. We are running a little bit of ways to make the Rotabaga do extra damage. One is by increasing it to a 2 2. The other way is instead of Bog, really wanted to go Coffee Grounds. Uh, this will make, again, uh, it'll work with Rotobig, also works with the Snapdragon. This makes, again, this thing do 6 damage splash instead of 3, as long as it's not dying, which, again, you have banana peels, so you're going to protect it. He had these party times on the field that were drawing, like, the reason he won was because of party time. The party times drew, like, 6 cards and kept him in the game. I uh, was able to win uh, late, actually, with a Gatling piece, so running the peas in the stack. Uh, the click piece, good value, just overall very good cards. This card happens to be very good with plant food, too. Uh, so it sort of justifies the plant foods, and it also sets up the Gatling P. Gatling P can just play anyway. Gatling P anyway does a bunch of bonus attacks with its double strike and its ability, so that will draw you a card using the party time. Thank you, Lab... Labur, for five months. So... I know this deck looks like it should have um, Bananasaurus Rex. I just know between the Snapdragons and the Repeat Maws that running more 4-drops, the Bananasaurus Rex would be, you know, it would work very well with the Party Time, obviously, and the Banana Peels, but uh, it just seems like it's going to be much. If this works and we can actually get a way to make this sort of deck work and just outvalue opponents, I don't even know what we're doing, uh, we'll definitely be able to make other versions of this deck um, either with Green Shadow or with other heroes, and, you know, I, I just want to see Party Time. I just got dominated by Party Time and Snapdragon in the same deck. I just want to see if it's possible for this deck to win consistently. Let's see how this deck does. I'm not running Plucky Clover, which we saw, instead we're just going to pile up some Gatling Peas. I think it's just the better card. Let's see how it goes. Hope you guys enjoy. Let's get right into it. I sent a friend request to him just now. Doesn't I don't, I don't know who this person is, but um, if anyone, again, knows... Eric GW2, send him over. Send the Giga Chad over to our stream. <laughs> Let's go. <sighs> uh, we'll do bets. If you think this deck will go 8 and 2, vote yes. 7 3 or fewer, vote no. The voting starts now. I'm so curious to see if people have faith in this deck. It seems like I'm just not used to decks that like tr go for, you know, mid-range circumstantial combos, which is kind of what we're doing here. I mean, this is fine. This is this is okay. I guess we keep party time. All right, let's go. It's a hand. Do I just take this out, or do I... We probably just take this out. At the end of the day, we're, we should really play this deck like a mid-deck, so I can't be greedy keeping party time to draw cards later when I don't even know... I don't even have those cards, you know what I mean? Um, 
something tells me we're gonna need to vegetation mutation next turn just looking at our hand so we're not really running threes you're always going for combos on three i'm probably gonna vegetation mutation and then banana peel something in if it's problematic like if he just plays like raptor or something it's dying for free next turn thanks banana peel there's rota vega I think it's just Rotobig and we'll save the banana peel. There's no need to the force it. So we have two ways of protecting this. One is with Super, the other is with Snapdragon. It's deadly. The Snapdragon will actually kill us for free. Snapdragon's almost always going here now, which is awesome. So far, this is cool. Just a really, again, I'm like usually not going for like, oh, the major value play. I'm usually just going for, um, I'm usually just go, I don't know, developing my own tempo, controlling. This is weird. So this doesn't really do enough. If we had coffee grounds, I would totally just coffee grounds and get this. It's got to be these, these cards, right? So let's see what we get. Split. Do I trade these? Or should I just go face? I probably do trade these because I do want something on heights to get buffed by this eventually, so this will clear this important lane. This becomes a very important lane because of our hands. <laughs> Alright, Chronium for two months. Thank you so much. No! God. Okay. Well, I guess that's gonna be a 4 4 now. The good news is the Snapdragon is pretty good here in terms of countering this guy. You know what, and that's also his really, really powerful superpower. That's just goodbye now. See ya. I guess so. Deadly, so nice. Uh, it does mean this grows though from the in, from the the dude. Good point. We could really use the plant food right now. Plant food would draw a card. This party time's valuable since we're getting low here. I don't know, man. He got both times he got the same card. That's hilarious. There's no point in, in using the the veggie yet. So we're just gonna spam this guy. And uh, we'll hopefully be able to put another minion and maybe use the mutation next turn. It's bonus attacking to kill a party time. Okay. Okay. It's like it'll, it'll pay off eventually. A plant food just wins now. I think we just set up lethal in a bunch of lanes here. Uh, hopefully he doesn't have chop and a rocket, I guess. Oh, okay, we won. <laughs> we got him. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, smoke bomb doesn't even help. All right. So far, Giga Chad. We'll call this Chad Shadow. Yeah. No, Green Shadow. Green Shadow the real name of the deck. Green Shadow is 1-0. Mermaid man does the susses. <laughs> Getting mad because of a mermaid. How ironic is that? I'm looking for a one drop. Come to daddy. Anyone having deja vu? Didn't this just happen? <laughs> same thing happened. Is this the same guy? It ain't, it ain't the same guy. That guy was an ultimate leak. 
Sure hope he wasn't. All right, we got this back. At least we can stifle the. Jeez. Really. Another space time. Pretty good play. This will punish him from playing a thing next turn. We can also snap this one next turn, which is cool. Play tells me Snapdragon in, in, in mid is going to be really, really good here. Heck yeah. That's a really good Invega though. Fight King. So it turns out there's no reason to Snapdragon here. I guess we might as well do it here. That's a really weird play of by him. I guess he has, he must have the environment. He must have the environment. Damn. Oh, he's gonna get us real good here. And there's no way to really prevent that, right? Alright, so let's just take... <sighs> so much damage. So, on five, I just don't know how we're going to deal with this next turn if we don't Snapdragon here. This is a little sad, but we're going to let the Black IP die just so this doesn't... He's definitely going for freeze. There's no other justification for this. There's no way. It, it, just now we can deal with this next turn, as opposed to before that would not have been possible. Hurts so much though, so much damage. Could buy blocks for the rest of this game. See you next time. We can do like five. It's so weird. Uh, all right, it's cheating time. <laughs> so the Viking stays in the ice mode, and then in middle is Mug. It hurts, because that means we can't do bonus attacks. And then space time is in one. Space time mug. I just wish we'd be able to kill this this goddamn guy now. There's no way to keep this alive to be able to do a second attack. That's the problem. There's no way. So we have to cover this. This sucks, man. It really sucks. I should have played this card though, at least, right? I messed up. Where would this have gone, though? There's no real lane for it. The, the, honestly, the mix of Gravedigger messed us up so badly. If this... If this... If the space time had been here... The space time here, we would have been able to put the environment here and double tap him. That would have been awesome. No, I don't know. I think we just lose. I'll probably put Roto Vega here and then snap here, maybe. I don't know how to deal with this, man. That was weird. Weird indeed. We have to not take this damage now, well. Huh? Could be worse. Coffee and three and veggie would not kill the, the Viking, because it doesn't do it doesn't do five damage splash. It only does three even if he has five attack. 
The only way to do six damage would have been to put coffee grounds in the middle, but it has to live. It doesn't do the second attack unless it lives, and five health is not enough to survive the mug. That's the problem here. We still might win this game now, actually. I just need to play a card plus a veggie and we'll be fine next turn. As, as long as this blob is dead. And teleportation zombie's dead. Thank you, Snapdragon. I mean, I don't, this nebula is terrible because he's not going to be able to use all of his brains anyway. Oh boy, we got him. So we're going to get a minion from this usually. Hopefully it's not just another banana, a banana bomb. Everything else, even a banana peel, we can play it and then get a minion. If he doesn't, oh, it's so annoying. <laughs> I don't think this is good enough. What is he gonna do? It's teleportation. Probably teleportation. I don't know. Probably still not worth it to use this, but maybe I'm wrong. Garbage. He is complete garbage. <laughs> oh my. His guy will do two. Teleportation station would have been really good to play there if he had his wits about him. Oh, that's cool. Okay. So this is seven, eight. Let's see if we get another minion here. We probably just win in lane one. God damn. Uh, I think that does it, though. He'll need to have a 4-drop here. We should probably just go for lethal. We, we can get 17 like this. Now, it means scooping this here. That teleportation... Um, zombie, though. Probably just makes us lose, right? He has to not have a minion. Chances are very low. Renana would not have helped. We probably go for lethal here, right? He probably does have a minion though. He has the guy. Oh, last turn. There wasn't a different way of doing that. Alright, we lost. Could also have rocket. Yeah, there's a lot of ways that goes wrong. Not much we can do there. <laughs> I feel like if he would have played not teleportation zombie, we would actually would have would have been able to pull that through. <laughs> Too bad indeed. Where's the one drops? Come on, man. Especially if he plays cheese cutter here, we're so messed up. We're like Giga Sad. <laughs> These are hilarious. Bag of hair is pretty good. Hello. 
Uh, I hope he doesn't have acid rain. That would suck. Maybe I should have played around. An Invidium there. Freeze would be way better. He has Neville though. What is that going to be? Is, I, I don't have a way to play around Tomb Razor. I just don't have a way to do it. That's crazy, man. Maybe it's Lie Dancing Zombie? Maybe I banana peel this here? If it's Lie Dancing Zombie, that's correct. If it's Pogo... This is better. Maybe I should put this here. And play around Pogo. Alright. Also charges block meter less like blind. That's so annoying. <laughs> this deck has so many problems. <laughs> Why? <laughs> How did he have two super? Oh, that was, he only had one. Oh, he didn't. Oh, he played Nibble last turn. God damn. I can't do anything because my hand is just been <laughs> What am I supposed to do? Okay, well, I guess you're moving here. This is so efficient. Hey, that's not bad. Should I move it again? Because we need a card? Yep. Alright, moving you again. <laughs> Come back. Yes, okay. Now we have a... Now we have some cheese right here. It's probably just another line dancing zombie. God damn it! I'm supposed to play around it again? I guess so. I thought it was gonna be Cryo Yeti. I don't know. We're so done. I needed those banana bombs too, man. I haven't gotten a card from party time yet. This deck. This deck's some BS. Dear freaking god. Where did he get this from? Okay, I can't play. I can't. This guy's the Giga Chat right here. Emson. I've switched my mind. This doesn't do anything. <laughs> I want to play PUZ Hero so badly. Can I please get plant food? That did not help at all. Zero. I want to play PUZ Heroes. No. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen. Nice to meet you. My name is Edward So Done. Because I am so done. Damn, this guy, though. I'm not making any terrible misplays here, right? Alright, guys, it's still possible. This is very sad indeed. What? <laughs> I'm like trying to think if there's any chance of us surviving. No. No, we're done. We are Dunzo McFunzo. I can't even play the banana peel. You're useless. You're complete garbage. <laughs> banana peel overrated card. The banana peels lost us that game. I didn't make any major misplays there, right? Oh, we need Plucky Clover, obviously. That would have been good. What are the bets, by the way? Did everyone just vote no? Are you smart? 68% voting yes? <laughs> Why? I feel bad for you guys. 
Maybe we just need Gatling P to carry. I can't do anything with this hand. I can't. Okay. There's too many bit. You can't keep banana peels in your starting hand. It just doesn't work that way. Play back of dancers. I don't know. This is very sad indeed. This actually goes in four because we have so much splay. I don't have to worry about splashing into the amphibious land against Brainstorm. But you just want to set up multiples. Like, two and three is the, are the main lanes you're putting your splash cards, basically. Sad summoning. Considering crafting Thresh, no, man. In, there's, there's a lot better heroes to craft than Thresh. He looks way better than he is. He only is good with very if the other hero in the deck is very expensive, and even then, he's very hard to pull off. I don't know what's going on here. Uh, craft three Nars and said, "Yep, yeah, Nars good in every deck, even if there's no synergy. It doesn't matter." <laughs> wow, still nothing. What is he going for? He didn't do anything there, he's just feeding. Feed city. Okay, now we got the plant foods. Maybe we just needed more plant foods is what we needed. I don't know, man. Is he going for chickening here? This is still how you play around chickening, right? We're talking about Legends of Rune Terror right now. Guys, we're playing PvZ Heroes. I should stream Legends of Rune Terror today. We don't really have a roast to write. Maybe I'll play a little bit. I'll show you guys. I'm doing some really BS deck right now. Okay. Wow! Damn, is this Falkster, by the way? It, like, feels like Falkster. He teleported that in? That's crazy. That's a crazy ride. Final mission, right? <laughs> oh, yeah, brother. Oh, we're in great shape now. Splash! Banana peel. It's very appealing. Screw this guy. <laughs> Too slow. That's not how you balance here. See? Thinking cap is where it all went wrong. He ain't surviving this turn. He's dead. What is he gonna do? He can't even, like, chump lock lane three. Can't do a damn thing. This still does three damage, by the way. It's splash, so this dies for free no matter what. That's such a terrible play, man. That's the worst summoning you could possibly do, bro. Come on, man. People who look, Valkyrie's not a good deck. He's not playing it right, and he's not running the right deck list. That's the two reasons why people think Valkyrie's not a good deck. Bro. Did he just survive this turn? Gosh. I don't care. I'm changing the... He's probably just going to OTK Valkyrie right now. Where did he get backup dancers from? Alright guys, we're finally drawing a card from party time. <laughs> Don't worry about it. It's a theoretical card. It only exists in theory. The Burn Boogaloo? I've tried Burn Boogaloo on stream before, just look it up. Be on YouTube. Nope. 
Not how you Valkster, guys. People misplay the deck and then they're like, so good. Anyone know what Valkster's win rate in the Pantheon tournament was? That Saman could whip that up in a couple couple minutes here. He tried Skyweaver? No. Let's go. Could have killed him with a banana. I don't want Oh, the, the wind is disappearing. This probably should have gone in one. Whoops. At least I can protect it. Beam me up, gets punished. It's not even called Valkster, it's called Valtrickster Hybrid. It's not even the correct name. Mm. Mm. No one cares. See how few people care? In Pantheon won? What? Didn't? I won more than two games personally with, with Valtrickster Hybrid. Why would you say two and nine? Yes, value. <laughs> Just trying to think about next turn here. I think it's like this. Wow, the punish. Why is he not killing this one? That's a 5 2. It's better. <laughs> I don't understand this. I don't get it. It's not a good play. Oh, it went 0 and 9 according to this guy, okay. This is not gonna need to get splashed here. I don't know, this seems sad. The Snapdragon doesn't do a damn thing here. Not a damn thing. Alright. Guess we're just spamming minions. Snapdragon is a 4 cost 3-3. Three, three. Of course, the lane Snapdragon still getting no value. Zero. Freaking zero. <laughs> The lanes in this deck, man. We need a leap. Watch him top deck rocket science. Bruh. He actually survives. No, it doesn't. Yes, it does. The 
This is so sad. <laughs> the saddest day for every Jew. What's the difference between Shamrock and Rocket Science? I made literally an entire video dedicated to answering that question. Look it up, bro. Yay, we won. Why is this deck so sad? Alright. Alright guys, there's some things just not working here. There's some things. There's a thing or two. We need some threes. Yeah, we need we need Captain Cucumber is what we need in this deck. I think these Rotobagos were complete garbage too. Let's just get rid of them. Let's make this into an actual good deck now. Now that we're halfway through the stream. Coffee grounds actually wouldn't be that bad anymore. And this kind of justifies it. We should run Lily, is what we should run, guys. Now, Lily, that's a good card. Let's run Lily. Plucky Clover. <laughs> uh, no. Decks are always subject to small amounts of change. We say that every day. I didn't say it today. It's always subject to change. I should for real run Bananasaurus Rex in this deck. Alright guys, we don't know that he was running that many Snapdragons, right? We have no evidence. Completely butchering this. This, this is actually probably a really, really good card in this deck. Think of all those space times we could have bounced with this thing. And teleportation zombies. Those are the things that are beating us anyway. Alright. And it also does have synergy with banana peel because you can very opportunistically move things into it if it makes a good trade, you know? Like this on the field, it's just a 2 1 after bounce of space time, but with banana peel, banana peel becomes a free bounce, so. I like this. I like this better. And it is another P for Gatling. The Gatlings kind of didn't do enough, but now they probably will do more. So, hell yeah, brother. Mosses. Well, we didn't really get repeat moss. We kind of just mul mulliganed out of our starting hands. Could be about mulliganing correctly. We repeat mosses the whole deck. These are good against Rust Ball. I'm just gonna keep them. We'll have a combo. Uh, we take those. We definitely take. That's a dangerous card. We've learned the we've learned the the fun way how dangerous of a card this is. You, you take that trade. 
So just letting the charger block meter. It just grows. Eventually. I mean, he can't do anything about a 4-1. Do I just keep this off the field? This will probably be a very important and difficult card to remove later. His party tree gets us to 5, though. Ugh, and so does Rockwall. Alright. I guess we're just going face. That works, too, I guess. Hopefully we'll get a Gatling and punish him. Block meter diff. Did you all ones? No, just one and a two. We're not scared of Rockwall anymore. Hardy Tree he might have used? I think it's okay. Nice to set up these party times early for the B-Rex. Probably. Does he have the answer to a 4-1 here? He needs a hearty treat. Even two tricks is not enough. It's so really nice if we can get him here. Yes! Get <laughs> We're fine. I'll probably just B-Rex for a bunch of value in there. So he either has Chop Heal or Rockwell. It's we hard to imagine the world where we don't banana source Rex here. Guess if he makes an amazing play in mid. But uh We are fine! We get the card draw actually before, which is nice. Nice that the B-Rex is to the left and these are to the right. I never realized these are supposed to be on the right in the field. I never use this card. But look at the value. Drawing two cards. This will get up to 6-6. Six, six. The blocks! The Embiggen? I mean, it dies to plant food anyway next turn. I think yes, the Embiggen. It's a 4-1. Is it only turn four? Oh no, he stole one of my brains. Burr. Chop is very so likely. Imagine not plant fooding here. It's like this. Because like, he, he needs to use hard removal on my cards. Yeah, this is correct. It draws two cards. This grows anyway. He needs to use harder removal to just survive here, and he ain't gonna have it. I mean, he'll have it, but he just won't. He'll still take a lot of a lot of heat. There's the chat. Does he have the rocket? Rolling stone. See if we can roll one here. The so one, two, three can actually play a few four fours on the field. So this is gonna be six plus five. There's no way to win here, right? Six, five. 
it also prevents this from growing. Oh, and we also draw an extra card. I think that's right. Kind of playing around going far. Uh, brute strength makes him win. That's basically it. Most of the summons are not gonna are gonna get blocked. They also will always happen after this damage. So. I think we're okay here. Now, unless he has a California roll, we win in like every lane. We have lethal, in, yeah, in one three lanes. And this lane, he'll have to put a non gravestone in to just be able to survive, because otherwise we have this. Aha. We need to keep drawing cards from party time. It's very important. Okay. Now we can win. <laughs> Goodbye. I think against uh, Paparazzi, this deck did reasonably well there. Again, very difficult because we don't have any small removal. Green Shadow is not one of our weaknesses. No way of killing those little engines like Paparazzi and T-Shirt. So. How you guys liking the stream so far? I think it's. I think we're we're rolling here. I think we'll keep this synergy with the cucumber. Right, just like Shamrocket, but then there's Fruit Cake that costs two. Uh, I think Fruit Cake's o OP, unlike Shamrocket. Shamrock's not necessarily OP. I just, I don't think you guys realize why I don't like Shamrocket if you're comparing it to Fruit Cake. Please watch the Shamrocket video. Pleasure to play against you. Were you the last guy? I don't know, guys. We can just make a good trade against this next turn if we want to. This can also grow when we get a second click thing. It becomes increasingly better. Shave your head for the full Canadian style. My girlfriend doesn't like it. If he has the Rolling Stone. Even Hardy Tree to Rockwell, it's not great. Yes! Wow! GetWreck.org. Just wasting his car. I don't know what's going on with this guy. This guy's strange. He is a strange. Do I even Captain Cucumber here? Is he going for? I should probably play around Weed Spray. Um, I'm actually gonna buff this one because it's a way better play against Rocket Science. I mean, any trick. That doesn't kill the 2 1, he gets punished by the 2 1. Oh my gosh. We just spread love in a few lanes. This is fine. This guy's so dead. We have this planet. Um. Man. I think not. We have this next turn, perhaps. We also have Banana Peel into Super. I never thought this was a combo. Banana Peel, Precision Blast is amazing. Punished again. Well, GG, Yanya. Just super to face, right? Yeah. 
Edward Sodan over here. I just don't want to hit face for one. I'll take the five. That's more damage than we have on the field right now. He's just still pumping up my black eye feeling. Delaying the inevitable. Look at this combo. Very cool indeed. Actually, our cucumber lives. Screw it. Let's go like this. Cool. Oh, it caught zero. Get wrecked. <laughs> Bye, see ya. <laughs> ah, the zero cost banana bomb. Love to see it. And cucumber lifts and heals and all kinds. I don't know what's going on. Yeah, teleport. There's no minions. Great. I think this deck's doing pretty well. That's a lot of healing. Unfortunately, can't make a play. Maybe we'll tap like a plant food or another banana. Plant. At least, come on, plant food. Aha. All right, guys, five and two. Come on, he ain't coming back from this. I mean, maybe. Try hard with the Founder badge. I take naps. I take naps and win <laughs> I'm here to take naps and win games. And I'm all out of naps. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> nope. Cucumber st- Oh no, Cucumber dies. <laughs> Maybe we'll roll a- Maybe we'll roll a 1. We will get an actual good card here. This is not good. Can I get something good, please? Okay, that's fine. We take this. No block still. How would we not block this game? We're down to 12 health. Dude, that's the first time he's hit us for at least three, right? I don't know what's going on. How no, has he blocked three times already? Yes! Fine, I don't care. Okay, okay. Do we not have lethal? Oh no, we have to kill the teacher. Whoops. Duh. That's just to kill the teacher there. These two should have been switched around and I still bonus the teacher. Oopsie daisy. Oopsie poopsie. Yeah. <laughs> I messed up the play. We still win. Playing cards. Something good eventually will happen. Not really. Not really, folks. Uh, five and two. Okay. Oh my god, there's way too many crossover questions from LOR to Fusey <laughs> Heroes here. 
You guys, it's, it's getting me. Do we keep Snap here? It just seems so good. All right. Why did he use bonus so I could win that turn though? I needed to put bread. I usually won that turn and I did. Maybe why did I use bonus? Why did you use bonus? Do I just not play this now? I'm gonna have to, right? Just finals this now. on the final mission this one. Maybe this was stupid. Kind of forces him to make this play now. Pretty inefficient. Oh, I actually went up to the cliff here. Now we drag things off of this, which is so cool. is a mobile game like Hearthstone or Lore, but the cards are NFTs that you can get and play for free and sell. So far seems like a decent game too. NFT <laughs> based game? That doesn't sound fun. Here? Damn. How's he gonna win though? Desperate for cards, that's a good sign. I think we just re automatically remove whatever he plays next turn anyway. Damn, we gotta start developing these click bees. I guess it's five, six. This pine clone's garbage. What is that though, man? Blind dancing zombie. There's nothing we can do to play around it too, it's guaranteed lethal. Come on, man. Seriously, are there any other cards that win him the game? He missed? He has guaranteed lethal if he moves us into two. 
still not enough. He missed. He missed for the win. He missed for the win. I can't believe he had guaranteed lethal. Now we have guaranteed lethal. Why did he not bungee this one? He could have at least stayed alive this turn. Okay, he's just completely debating us. Oh my gosh. We just got VN so hard. <laughs> I literally believed that for a, for a hot minute. Now the fail comp is the fact that I got debated that hard into getting VM'd. I can't believe <laughs> Okay. Well, I guess the answer is no to the... So much for Giga Chad. Wow. I actually, he actually had me. Wait, I should have definitely known, right? <laughs> Pretty dumb to, to have fallen for that. We need a leap! Pretty we dumb. Need a leap! <laughs> LMAO for that BM. Uh, at least he is well versed in the way of the BM. That's all I gotta say. God damn. I got debated so hard. <laughs> All right, the answer is no, guys. We tried to do the Giga Chat. Obviously, the problem is not the deck, guys. The problem is me not being a, a chat enough to be worthy to play this deck. That's what's really going on. I don't even go after it. Take notes, guys. That's how you BM. He, that guy BM'd me in steps. Just gonna go on viral or something. I'm just gonna wait till he's actually relying on this for a combo before we blow it. It's really no. I mean, at the end of the day, Teacher is, is one of the cards that just wreck Screen Shadow. There's nothing really we can do. Right? <laughs> I'll freeze something later. What's the combos with this? Probably have to do it now, right? I probably should have banana peeled there, though, just to get a banana. Okay. That'll probably slow him down enough here. <laughs> yeah. I don't think he's gonna be able to deal with uh with B Rex here. Blow the teacher. Guys, we blew the teacher! I can't believe it. After all these years, we have finally, once again, blown the, the teacher. That's cool. We use, uh, what block? Wow, look at the blocks. You know what? We have so many cards that draw cards in our hand. We, we have, we're, we're gonna, we have to just play this, right? He nerf it. He had acid rain, jeez. Make him have to deal with this? He he held his superpower, right? He might just have chop.
does draw a card, so... Yeah, but he just draws the one and this gets bounced. Definitely damage control there. Why? Oh my gosh, that's so harsh, bro. This teacher is dominating us. We can't do anything. Does he just win? No, but, I mean, he's gonna win next turn. There's nothing we can do about that, man. There's nothing, okay? We can't, we can't counter teacher. There's no way. Maybe if we had plant food. Uh, should I run a fourth plant food? Repeat moss wouldn't be bad here. Really wouldn't be bad. We just can't deal with teacher. It's impossible. Literally. I guess I'll play around him not having a, uh... This doesn't even do enough, though, the star fruit. Is there any way to win here? Banana peel's dead. <laughs> what a surprise. Did I just have to bring Nana? We usually block. Maybe I'll just bring Nana and maybe we can pull some, some miracle plant food off next turn. That's probably actually the play. We can't plant food. We can't really add attack. We usually block here. Uh, a hardy tree would have been sad. Eh, we're fine. We can actually win this game still. Come on, plant food. Cringe. We can't even move things out of the way. We can't buff anything. There's this thing. <laughs> I don't know. Thought it was so good. Yeah, so he just wins here, guaranteed, right? Snapdragon freeze? No, we have to go for a quick lethal. We're never gonna out of value this guy at this point. It's impossible. Bro. Say things like that. Actually, this could work. This could totally work. It's gotta be star in one. Yeah, that's it. He has to not get a rolling stone. God damn it! <laughs> Even teleport anything that is not a gladiator there, we'd still be okay. We played a- well, I guess bonus attack wins anyway. Come on, man! <laughs> Chad not- not picking in. Lack a day. Lack a goddamn day. All right, one more game, guys. One more game for this for the Giga Sad deck. <laughs> K-Troll? I see this guy way too much. This guy must be a sniper. So he's playing some dumb Infinity deck, too. Yeah. You know what? Screw this guy. I am playing with you. Get permanently banned. Kelly, more like Nar Kelly. <laughs> the ultimate diss in the Frime upstream. I, f 
friends of him already. Harsh. You think I'm gonna fall for that? I don't know, it's still kind of sad. He's definitely going for Rolling Stone though, right? Should I just ruin his day? I feel bad. I feel like this is better later anyway. Where did this go? Yes, it goes here. We have to read all of his messages. He said, shut the F up, I'll smack you boy. I'm black, I'm black, he just keeps on saying I'm black. <laughs> then he puts a phone number, call it, oh my gosh, it's not a scam. Then he says, shut the F up dude, or someone saying they're from Iran. I don't like it. I don't like it at all. There, we read all of his messages. That's called racial baiting. That's what it is. I don't like that. Wow. That's a real Giga Chip. Why am I getting Cornucopia? That's like the worst thing to get. It's not even good at 9. This man got way too much stuff going on, man. Can this be pass as we go closer? Are you a pa pacifist? Yeah. Oh, yeah. We probably actually still play this, right? for two years. There you go. Welcome to the stream. Now we can banana peel this to death. <laughs> the best way to die. Death by banana peel. How did- why did he do that? That's weird. I kill you. We have bananas for- for ages now. Hey, we can win. Yeah, it could be super to face was actually better there. And then move it, yeah. He only has six health. It's definitely better. 
could always block smash, but I guess he can just has more chances of block. Well, it's almost no chance of blocking. And we win anyway. I'm rolling all ones. All right, guys, that was the Giga Chat. I think that was definitely a, a fun enough stream to go on YouTube, and the fact we actually did this deck is hilarious. I don't know, man. It just seems like there's these crazy... It probably just depends on the type of deck you're running. I think a deck like the Neptuna deck where you're playing a lot, making a lot of plays, we didn't get Pogo Mug in that match yesterday, and that's... I, I think Pogo Mug would have been able to absolutely destroy what he was doing with Snapdragon and friends. Um, but if you don't have that, in a deck where you're swarming, so the splash damage does a lot, where you're playing a lot of minions dry, which the flag zombie deck, you're obviously much more minion based, so then Snapdragon gets values and he can use banana peel, you know, for setup plays and stuff like that. But yeah, I mean, I don't know. <laughs> against reactive infinity decks and, uh, it, and against teacher that we lost to like two times today. It's, it's rough. Uh, paparazzi, just things that need small removal to keep targets. I know flag zombie can really be, it's not really exactly the same thing. It's more expensive. Anyway, guys, uh, that was definitely a fun stream. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'm going to say yes to YouTube. Peace. This is right.